And we are back between two Yetis with John Nigro. How are you, sir? Wonderful. And you're now with Informa though, right? Informa, which has purchased show management. Interesting. And we are, actually, this is the first show we've done. We are T minus five days from the show start or four days? We, we start on the 25th. Right. Excuse me. Cancel that. We start on the 22nd. Okay. And that's Thursday when? Thursday the 22nd, through Friday Sunday. the 23rd, Saturday the 24th, Sunday the 25th. Excellent. We're in Palm Beach and... Uh, a lot of people tell me this is their favorite show. Why is that? Most beautiful boat show in the world. Really? Parking accessibility is simple. Parking yep. garages mm -hmm. in every location. Easy access from all of the interstates. Three cocktail barges, one at the south, one at the center, one at the north. Food, beverages at your fingertips. After the show is over, restaurants, nightclubs, hotels. Plenty of things to do in the evening. Yeah, absolutely. But this is the, is it the last show of the season for you guys? We have one more show after this, which is the Sarasota or the Suncoast Boat Show. Which is your favorite? Palm Beach, right here. Is that because it's easier to set up most, than Miami? Most or? beautiful boat show in the world. Greatest people regarding the city to deal with. Easy accessibility for the exhibitors. Very easy entrances for locations to bring all of the, the exhibitors in for staging of the boats, setting up of the exhibits, setting yeah. up the exhibits in the tents. It just works. It's a beautiful event. And do you see this show just getting bigger and bigger every year? As where we are sitting is a massive expansion for this year. As you can see, the South Cocktail Barge and the Come By Boat Dock, yeah. which is at the south end of the show, last year was a little bit further north than that location. So with the expansion for the demand of more boats in the water, mm -hmm. we've expanded the show further south. Do you see it getting bigger and bigger, or are you yes. limited on space that you we, can do? We, the show is going to get bigger. Interesting. How much buy do you think per year? Just Can't tell you. We don't know yet. <laughs> but that's the plan. To get the plan bigger is to bigger get bigger, naturally. Within, with Informa behind us, I'm sure the show is going to get bigger. So where did you start with all this? You've been with the company for years. 20 years. I started uh, as a salesperson 20 years ago. I was hired by Andrew Duell. Right, yeah, obviously. Yep. I was hired September 8th of 1998. I was given a layout and thrown into the Fort Lauderdale Boat Show <laughs> and said, do it. Wow. Okay, let's go. And it's been a ball game ever since. It's been great. Because there must be a lot of stress with this job, right? There's, I mean, a, there's a fair amount of stress. But I mean, I, just, I did see a, the potential of an argument on the dock a few we, minutes ago. We, we handle, <laughs> you're right, we handle the stress very, very well. We've got great relationships with every exhibitor mm -hmm. that comes to all of our boat shows. It's a, it's a first name basis. We've got cell phones from each other. It all works. Because what's the number one tip you give someone coming into this informer? Like, right, boat shows are going to be crazy. This is what you need to do to work. Take I mean, it easy. Mm -hmm. Keep calm. Talk to us. We're here to help you out. Mm -hmm. And we'll all get it done. Thursday morning, when the show opens, the skies are going to clear. It's going to be beautiful. People are going to come in. Everybody's going to be happy. That's got to come this way. Yeah, that's what they said, but they said they yeah. can't wrap. They no, that, to wrap. That, he's got to come this way. Got he's got to yeah. come this way, and the tent has to be moved. Logistics. Logistics? Operations. How do you move a tent like that? Is it just we, unbolt we, and move it down? We or? make a phone call, <laughs> and the guys come in with the tent. The dock crew, Yeah. they come and move everything. This is the puzzle that we are building. Good heavens. Okay. I mean, it's, everything's just a moving target right now. That's then, it. Yeah? It's, all, it's all a moving target. That's why you guys can see how it works. Yeah. Okay. We've got to accommodate the vessels as they're coming in. Yep. It's a challenge for some people to come in backwards, dock it, maneuver all around. We've got a dock crew that helps them, brings the boats over, helps the lines. We've got an additional crew that will move the tents for us. We've got it covered as far as whatever has to be done to accommodate the exhibitor. What's the worst case scenario when you're setting up a show to happen? Is it weather? Is it's it thunder and lightning? Thunder and lightning. At that point, do you have to shut down? Yeah, we we are very very cautious. And what happens if there's like boats out here? You just like guys wait well, there. Well, we, we're them. we're gonna wait for the storm to pass, mm -hmm. and it usually does. Luck is usually on our side. The wind blows it through. Yep. And then we continue. Because even during the show, your job never stops, does it? No, 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 nobody stops during the show. Do you even get busier when the show's open, yes. do you think, rather than we, set up? Or? Thursday morning when the show opens, it's a little bit of madness. Yep. There's a lot going on. We have to respond to the exhibitor requests. Mm -hmm. Every one of the divisions is on radio. We can reach them by cell phone. We have to fix the tent. We have to fix an electric line. We have to fix something on the docks. It's handled. 
God, that's amazing. I always anticipate this would be the madness, but are you actually saying it's during the show? It's like and, the madness. And as we go back to the city side, during the show, we have to maintain accessibility. We have to be ADA re uh, compliant to make sure that people that require assistance, walking around, moving around the show, that there's no obstructions. Interesting. So we are constantly aware of the surroundings at all times. Well, John, I won't take any more of your time, but uh, thank you very much. Thank for you. Time. And if we get you during the show, that'll be Yeah, whenever you guys want.